Hey, hey, and welcome back to my channel. It's Ashley here, and if you are new, hey girl, hey. So today in this video, I'm gonna show you how you can transform some spaghetti jars. So if you wanna know how to do that, keep on watching. So I got these two spaghetti jars. So you can literally use spaghetti, pasta, pickles, whatever you have, and you can transform them and do whatever you want. So for this DIY, what I did was I removed the labels. And to remove the labels, first I used my um, razor as usual, but it was not working. So what I had to do was I had to actually soak these jars and then take a scrub brush and scrub the label off. So after I scrubbed the labels off, I got some frosted glass. So I recommend getting the frosted glass from Walmart because it's about like, I think it's like $3.96 and it's cheaper than getting it from Michaels, even using a coupon. Um, and I'm not quite sure if Hobby Lobby has it, but just go, if your Walmart has this, get it from Walmart. So after I spray painted my jars, it was time to decorate. So for my first jar, I decided to just take some twine because why not? I'm obsessed with twine. I'm so sad that I haven't been using it like I did last year, but I just wrapped this twine around the top of my jar. And then after I wrapped that twine around the top of the jar, I decided to add like a little dangling piece using some snowflakes so these snowflakes I got from Hobby Lobby don't remember the price but they are super inexpensive and you get a whole bunch of them so I'm using the wooden snowflakes and then I also used one of their metal snowflakes that they had they're actually like little paper clip kind of snowflakes so I used those as well so the first thing that I did was I took those snowflakes and I added the white snowflake on top of it and first I just like added the snowflake and like I took the prongs and put wrapped it around the back but then I was like oh well if this flips over that's not <laughs> really gonna work so I just took the prongs off with my scissors and then I attached two of those snowflakes to the front and the back of the wooden snowflakes and then after that I just attached the wooden snowflakes to the actual um, twine using my hot glue so after that I just added my two little dangly pieces I cannot think of the name right now or what you would call it tassels but they're not really tassels so I added these to the side of my jar and then I attached them in the inner portion of the jar with my hot glue and then I also attached the outside with the hot glue as well. So after I did that I decided to decoupage the bottom of the jar. So to do that I used the tissue paper that I got from Hobby Lobby. It's like a newspaper print so all I did was take my spray bottle and my Mod Podge and I sprayed the bottle and yes it was a bottle so I sprayed the bottle and then I added my Mod Podge and then I added my tissue paper and that literally was it for this first DIY and then you can just add an LED candle in there light it up and make it look super cute honestly it was giving me like frozen vibes I feel like because frozen just came out but it was a cute little thing with the snowflakes and you can make tons of these and add them anywhere into your decor this year so for my second jar it was literally like another little simple thing that you can do so I honestly had tons of different ideas for this one but I just decided to keep it simple and again with the jar I just took the frosted glass and I just spray painted that onto the outside of my jar and then after I spray painted it to the outside of my jar, I decided to again add that same twine to the top and then I added my tissue paper to the bottom and then what I was gonna do to this prior I was just like no that's not gonna work so I just eventually added my twine to the bottom as well to cover up half of that and then the other half is going to be your um, tissue paper so after that I added some of my Santa snow using my adhesive first so I sprayed the adhesive around the lid and then I also sprayed it inside and then I took that Santa snow and I just sprinkled it around the top and I sprinkled it around the inside and it was good to go and then all you have to do again is you can add an LED candle in there and then you can light it up and make it look cute add it to any other decor if you have your fireplace even in your room or something like that where your TV is I don't know <laughs> you can put it anywhere and I just love how these are they're simple easy to do 
and simple and easy is literally the same thing but they are very easy to do and you can get this done in a day especially if you have all the supplies that you need and they will make any space look very nice and cozy and if you like that real natural look these are going to be perfect for that because of course everything that I used is neutral so I hope you enjoyed this video if you did as always make sure you give this video a thumbs up if you're not a part of my email list again you're going to want to get a part of that email list because I have a special offer coming up if you haven't watched my latest video you can watch it up here and if you have not subscribed to my channel make sure you click on that subscribe button and I will see you in my next one bye